I've been assigned to work with this program that I've never seen before. I was told that it's very complex and calls a lot of other programs. So I decided to use the runtime visualizer, which is a new part of Topaz program for program analysis, to get an idea of how this thing is constructed. I was able to just submit the program, have it run, and didn't need the source, minimal setup, and it's drawing the chart while it's running. So I can see, as you can see, it's running through here, and I can see the chart. It's being built. Uh, I can see the modules. I can see that 31 was being called a lot, now 32. So that gives me an idea of the things that are being run a lot. These are all different programs involved that it's calling. A lot of them, you can see the numbers here I have the number one. Those are probably initialization modules. I'm just hitting those a few times, but then other ones like that 33 were being hit a lot. So even at this quick pace, I'm getting a good feel for it. And I can see some of these counts going up, like this 32, it's now up to 150. I can see the DB2, the calls being made there. I'm starting to get a list of programs that I, I need to focus on out of this big, complex, uh, massive programs. Down below, I can see the, uh, the table that shows all the different calls. So I can see it's a trace that this program calls that program. I see the library. I can see the compile date. So I can make sure that it's the right module. And that this can be saved, and I can use it later so that I can export it, run it through a spreadsheet, really examine it there, or even better, bring it back in and replay this for someone else. Say, hey, I think this is how it's all working. Run it through, and everyone can see it's great for code reviews, too. So it's finished, and now that I'm looking at it, I'm starting to really look at those counts. I see that this one here, this program calls DB2 6,996 times. I've got another one, 1402. So those are ones I definitely want to look at, this one as well. So it's narrowed down the list of things, and I've got a really good idea of this. And I can also export this picture if I wanted to and work with it. So my next step will be to take these programs that I'm interested in and bring those up in Topaz for program analysis so I can look at the chart there and see the logic flow, get a feel for the logic, see if that's where I need to make my change. Another option is to bring those up in Expediter and run through them. But the important thing is I now have an understanding of this program and all the calls and something I can go back to and it's narrowed down my list to the programs that I'm really interested in. So I'm ready to get going.